Welcome to us. I'm back, guys. I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. It's been a while. It has been a while, guys. But I've been really, 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 I've had to take a break from doing my readings for, I had to give my myself some time to register a lot of things that has been going on in my hometown, Brunswick, Georgia. Um, as a lot of you may have heard the story of Ahmad Arbery in the small hometown of Brunswick, Georgia. Um, I was raised there. My children went to school there. I went to school there. My family is from there. We're, that's where I, we are from. Um, I'm, I'm glad that things are being exposed about Brunswick, Georgia. Certain things needed to be exposed. It was over, time has been overdue. Like it's been overdue, um, long overdue. But it's so sad that a life had to be taken um, in order for us to be heard, our sides of the story to be heard. And it's just a, a, a really hard thing to actually wake up one day and see an actual video of someone being gunned down for jogging, okay, and being in the wrong neighborhood. Um, sad, sad story, sad case. And uh, my city has been grieving and mourning this since February. And we're just now getting a, a little bit of justice, okay, because Brunswick, Georgia is, is not done. Um, just because an arrest has finally been made, which we've been waiting on an arrest for all going on three months. But we're not done. We want a conviction. We want everybody who was involved to, um, that all the people that were involved to get, we want full justice. Everybody involved, every accomplice, everybody to, to get what they deserve, period, point blank. So that's where my focus has been for the past couple of days, guys. Um, there's been protesting. There's been marches. Um, and I've just been standing with my city, guys, with my hometown. Because I no longer reside in Glen County. But all of my family and friends, you know, are there. And it's hit close to home. All right. So let's get into you guys this reading. And I want to also say uh, today is Ahmad Aubrey's birthday. He would have been 26 years old today. And it's just a tragic story, guys. It's just a real tragic story. But I do know that justice will, will be served. Okay, so now that I've got that out the way, guys, I had to give you guys an explanation why I haven't really been as active on the readings, okay, for the month of May. But I am getting to it, guys. I am getting to it. All right. So let's 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 get into let's get into some things. Taurus, what message is there for my Taurus? If you are new to the channel, guys, don't forget to click the bell to subscribe. This message may or may not resonate with you. If it does not resonate with you. Check your moon and your rising. You may find your message there. All right, so let's get into some things. What message is there for my Taurus? I'm hearing for I'm hearing five. I'm gonna shuffle five times. You know, guys, I've been seeing the number five, five, five for the past couple of weeks, and I knew that some type of change was was coming or on the way. And I'm just hearing the number five. Okay, I'm getting the number five, three. One more time. All right, five. Bam, let's do this. I'm getting that there is has been like a halt. Okay, I got the chariot in reverse, the ten of swords in reverse, and the knight of cups reversed. Let's see what's going on. 
I got the Three of Pentacles reverse. I got the Three of Wands reverse. Lots of threes. There could be um, three people, third party situation, three people involved. The number three is sticking out. Seven of Wands in the reverse. Page of Pentacles in the reverse. Past energy, Ten of Cups in reverse. Future energy is the Death card. I got the Lovers in reverse. You could be dealing with the Gemini. I got the Five of Pentacles in reverse. I got the Nine of Wands in reverse. And I also have the King of Wands in reverse. Lots of reversals here. Lots of reversals here. You may feel like something is not, someone isn't cooperating or something isn't coming together. Okay. There may be some type of disagreement or some type of disagreement that you're trying to get past with the Seven of Wands in the reverse. And you could be waiting for an explanation or waiting to talk or hear some hear some type of news. Um, why is the three of pentacles here in the reverse? Eight of swords in reverse. I got the justice card here. Seven of Swords reverse and the Eight of Pentacles. Someone's trying to take um, matters into their own hands with this Justice card here. Someone here, you could be feeling stuck, okay? You're waiting for something. Why is the Three of Wands here? All right, you're waiting to see what's going to be said. Page of Swords. This is communication coming in. This is hearsay. This is word of mouth, okay? Why is the Page of Swords here? You're waiting to see how something's going to work out. That's what I'm seeing here. Why is the Page of Swords here? Five of Wands. There's lots of reversals here. I feel like there's some type of issue. There's some type of disagreement because i see the five of wands as well as the seven of wands i feel like there's some type of disagreement you're waiting to see um what's going to come out of it okay waiting to see what's going to be said about it why is the page of pentacles here in the reverse i'm getting that there may have been like some some news that you really didn't want to hear king of cups in the reverse could be involving a pisces cancer scorpio but someone here has been very um, cutthroat, very cut and dry, okay? And they have been lacking sympathy here. This could be you, but someone here is lacking sympathy, and they are speaking very blunt their truth. They're, they're speaking it very bluntly, okay? Why is the King of Cups here in the reverse? Four of Pentacles. I'm getting like holding a grudge. Someone here could be, you could be holding a grudge against someone, okay? Because of something that you saw, something that you heard. But I'm getting that there could be like a grudge here. Somebody was very hostile towards you. Um, why is the seven of wands here in the reverse? Six of cups. Six of cups in reverse. I got the devil. You could be dealing with a Capricorn, but it's in the reverse, okay? So this is, when it's upright, this is addictions, this is possessiveness, this is a greed and, and very negative energy. It's in the reverse, okay? So something here about releasing something from the past. I do feel like you guys are holding someone responsible or holding some uh, type of ill feelings about a situation, okay, that you saw or heard about something in that nature something that was that was sad here because i got the ten of cups in the reverse for you guys it's past the energy okay 
Ten of Cups upright is in is definitely emotional fulfillment. When it's in the reverse, it's you know feelings of being not emotionally satisfied. Why is the Ten of Cups here in the reverse? Sad story. Knight of Cups in the reverse. There's something that happened here in the past that was very sad or something that um, affected you in some, some way, some way, shape or form. Okay. Why is the Knight of Cups here in the reverse? We got the Hierophant Taurus, you guys, this energy. Something something shocking, okay? We got the Ace of Wands, the Tower, and the Justice card. The Justice card it has revealed itself a few few times. Some of you could be dealing with the judicial system, the court system. Um, you could be also dealing with a Libra. You could be trying to find balance in a situation, or there needs to be some type of balance in a situation. But something here um has been shaken and has um possibly happened out of the blue um i feel like it was something that could have been tragic or sad because i'm getting that there was some type of sad news okay why is the death card here for future energy could be dealing with a scorpio okay why is this death card here the fool okay not wanting to take some certain type of risk, okay? Not wanting to take a chance on something. There's something here that's hidden. We got the moon card here. There could be a Pisces involved. And we got temperance. Could be a Sagittarius. But I'm getting that there's a story here. But the the story is like, you know, a, it's still a mystery here. Why is the full card here? Eight of Wands. I'm getting like, you don't even want to hear this person's side of the story. That's what I'm picking up too. Like, it's two sides to a story is what I'm getting here. Two of Pentacles. This could be involving two or more people. I'm getting that there's two sides to a story. Because we got the moon and the temperance here. This just reminds me of a story, okay? I feel like you don't even want to hear what this, hear this other side of the story. Why is the Eight of Wands here? Eight of Pentacles. Reverse. Someone could be trying to communicate with you um, and tell you their side of the story or get their point across. I feel like you don't even want to hear it. You don't want to hear it. The Lovers Reverse. This may be a bad decision. You may feel like you that you know things did not go in your favor this could be involving love with the lover's card in reverse but i'm getting that someone made some type of bad decision here why is the lovers here reversed the star card yeah um could be dealing with an aquarius but someone here has definitely lost faith um in this situation you may feel like that this situation um there was a wrong decision or a bad decision okay But I feel like you guys have lost faith um, in a situation because I also see here that no effort is being put in. Yeah, you want you're, I feel like you're looking for something new with this Ace of Wands. You're looking for something new. I got the Queen of Wands reverse. Could be a fire sign, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. I feel like you don't want to hear this other person's side of the story. You don't want to hear it. I just I just keep getting like you don't want to hear it. I feel like you're afraid to let your guard down here with the nine of wands in the reverse. This is in the hopes and fears. I feel like you're afraid to kind of let your guard down towards this situation because I, I just really get like you guys don't want to hear this. Whatever this person did to you. Um, you feel like it was uncalled for, and I feel like you are holding a grudge. I, I I really do. I feel like you're holding a grudge against someone. Why is the King of Wands here in the reverse? 
Leo, Sagittarius, Aries energy. Ace of Pentacles, reverse. The Strength card. Some of you guys could be dealing with the Leo. I'm picking up Leo really heavy. Um, but I'm getting like you, someone here, you feel like this person is weak. You feel like this person is weak, a coward. I'm getting like a coward. You feel like this person is a coward. Why is the strength card reversed? I mean, I'm just getting like you feel like this person. Yeah, see, we got the devil here. Could be a Capricorn. Oh, Lord. Why is the devil here in reverse? Seven of Cups. And then the Seven of Cups is reverse. If this is a love relationship, some of you guys are going to possibly like have a decision to make on whether or not if you want to partner back up with this person, because I got the Two of Cups here, if you want to come back together with this person. Queen of Cups, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Some of you guys are dealing with the water sign, okay? All right, let's see what additional messages we have. All right, let's see. Taurus. What message is there for Taurus, please? All right. I just saw share your voice, okay? Someone needs to voice their opinion about something. All right, we got the initiation, rite of passage, crossing the threshold. Okay, we got the ever unfolding rose. Cracked open is happening for you, not to you. Okay, so this is something that you could be taking personal. This is a situation that you could be taking very personal, but spirit wants you to know that it's happening for you and not to you, okay? I feel like this is just the beginning of something, okay? Just the beginning of something that's bigger, like there's a bigger picture behind this, okay? I feel like you guys are really like, you guys are upset with someone and it's about the way a situation went down or how a situation was handled. Maybe you felt like someone was out of pocket and you're holding them accountable. Um, it was something that was devastating. It was something that was, I feel like completely bothered you. Completely bothered you. I got pillar of light. Your vibration is rising. You are the oracle. And I got don't dim your light to fit in. How are you dimming your light in order to fit in? Thank you, spirit. I got the great gathering. It's all coming together. All right? You got a soul tribe. It's all coming together. People are coming together. Okay? A tribe is coming together. Like, things are going to come together. The right people are going to come in to assist with this situation. I'm getting that this is bigger than love. Normally, uh, a lot of my messages stick strictly to love, but there's something bigger here. Um, there's something way bigger here. I'm not getting love. That's why I have yet to pull out any love cards here. I'm getting that this is something bigger. I got align your life. What is not aligned or needs to change? 
change is a big word that I'm getting for Taurus. I'm getting, like, I've been seeing the number 555. I've been seeing that quite often. And I was told by Spirit to shuffle five times. And I'm feeling like this is like the first time, really, that I've done a monthly reading here on my channel. And it doesn't really pertain to love. I did not get love anywhere in you guys' message. I felt more so that there's something bigger here. Okay, something bigger. I want to see what the angels have to say. All right, guys, let's see. What message do you have for my Taurus? Okay, I got forgiveness. Hmm. Forgiveness, no need to worry. Give me one more message for Taurus, please. And I got no. Then I got yes right here. If you believe, I feel like be assertive and get more information. And I feel like you guys are going to have helpful people around you. I get it that you guys have like a group of people around you that are supporting you. Okay. I got forgiveness. No and no need to worry. Let's get some clarifiers. Why is forgiveness here? Someone is holding back from an apology, from giving an apology, or someone is holding back from apologizing. Yeah, someone like, we got the judgment card here. Someone wants, a, um, someone's afraid to be judged or how they're going to be looked at if they were to apologize. I'm getting forgiveness, okay? I feel like someone is afraid to apologize or afraid of how they're going to be viewed if they do apologize. All right, so why there is no here? We got the Knight of Cups reverse. If someone asks, someone here is asking something and the answer is no, okay? I clearly see like no. No further questions. Um, what, why is the Knight of Cups here? Nine of Swords. Queen of Swords reverse. Libra, Gemini, Aquarius is energy. Ace of Pentacles reverse. Someone's, okay, this could be, someone could possibly like be trying to offer assistance or offer help and someone is saying no, is turning that offer down. Um, being very headstrong and um very assertive and i'm getting that there's some type of offer being made and someone is completely saying no they don't want it they don't want it okay so someone could be offering you an apology or offering you some type of you know way to uh, appease you and you are not accepting it Okay, so we have no need to worry. No need to worry. Knight of Swords. Something here is going to pick up and, and take off. Okay. Why is the Knight of Swords here? Lots of air energy here. Okay, lots of messages just wanted to come out as well. I'm getting like, don't give up. Wow, we got the death card and the nine of wands in reverse. I'm getting don't give up. Someone here, there's a fight here. There's some type of fight. And I'm, I'm just picking up don't give up. Five of pentacles reverse. The situation is going to improve, okay? 
and there's going to be something new, a new start, okay? Look at that, Hierophant. I'm getting that there's going to be, I feel, I feel like things are going to um, progress, okay? I'm getting, there's no need to worry. Something that you've been waiting on is getting ready to rush towards you, okay? And I'm clearly getting, don't give up. Don't give up. Better days are ahead. A new day is ahead. Five of Pentacles reverse, Ace of Wands. A new day is ahead. Coming out of a bad time is in the near future. Okay? And then we got the Hierophant card, which is you guys' card. Okay? And that's things being done the right way. That's things being done by the book. Okay? Moral conduct. Why is the Hierophant here? Four of Wands, reverse, where things were unstable, things are going to pick, things, I, I feel like something here is unstable. This could be something that has something to do with home life, okay? For some of you guys, this is a marriage um, that may be on the rocks, because I got the Hierophant and the Four of Wands here, but something that someone here was losing faith in this situation, Nine of Pentacles. Someone, you guys want to be comfortable. You guys want to be comfortable where you lay your head at, wherever. You guys just want to be comfortable. You guys got to let me know what's going on in the comment section below. I hope this message was helpful for you guys. And until next time, ciao for now. And happy birthday, Ahmad. I run with Maud. Peace.